Hello everybody, welcome back. I finished the prettiness on the top here. I haven't put anything on top of the roof line yet. That is going to be my next job off camera, off video, out of video, whatever you want to call it. But I did find the mossy tiles, um, shingles they're called. Um, if you go in here, it's called mossy wooden shingles. And you can change the color of them. So you can't change the color of the, of the clay bricks. And I thought the clay bricks were too light for in here, on this wall here. So I used the shingles instead. And I've put them on this and that section. I don't know what you think of it. Let me know. Um, we can also use them along the side on these sort of brick, concrete brick pieces here. Let me know. So today we're going to start out with a couple of sandbox things. We want some dead plants. Now I know we can buy, we used to be able to buy dead creepers. Yes, the wilted hanging ivy. And my thought process was we can throw some here. Wow. I don't want to overdo it, but I do think we need a bit. And it doesn't want to hang there. Why doesn't it want to hang there? Because there's other stuff in its way, you see. As soon as I put it close to the other brick, has a little bit of a nervous breakdown so we're just gonna have to put a couple of pieces here and then transfer them across what do you say now the move tool let's just use snapping because that helps and we'll throw it on the wall here do we want it on the no, we want it there, but we don't want it right there, so let's just move it there. And we've got a bit of stuff hanging around. I don't know if I like that there. Let's see. What? I, use, I hate this stuff, I really do, because it it, it, it's not a happy chappy in any shape or form and if you mess with it it just like just doesn't work so that'll work there maybe we can put little bit of dead stuff and we've got all kinds of other dead plants um, the only problem with with the ivy is it is a pain because yes I can place it on the stairs awesome sort of yes I can um, it's just very green isn't it is the ivy has got a, a specific look to it that if you take it or you repeat it too often it has a repeating pattern to it so that I don't enjoy but I'll drape it here there and everywhere at some stage and we'll put some nettles and some maybe broken stuff I'll, I'll put this onto my diet oh but I'm not going to put it as a job but it can be cleaned as far as I know if you just go in and clean it up 
Let me know. I have no idea. I actually haven't downloaded a job house from Mod.io, so I have no idea. Now, coming inside, we've got the fireplace here, and I've put a fireplace up top here as well. When we get to actually doing the the rooms, I'll decide what and how I'm going to deal with the fireplace on this side here. But I think this is going to be the living room. I've just thrown this in the window so I can take pictures, if you know what I mean. And we've got this color here, which is old clay bricks. We want paint. No, we want old paint. Here's the damaged paint, the old plaster. And then we can actually color it. So I think for the ceiling, let's go with this very neutral beige. If I go white, white's not bad either, hey? Let's see what white looks like here. that'll work and it'll reflect the red light quite nicely this is a big room that'll work and we need stairs so I've allowed quite a large gap in the roof for stairs I don't know if I want stairs in a U, so sort of there, up, and then this way. So maybe we should try something. Let's do that and see what... Oh, I left a gap here. I always leave a gap. What have we got to work with? 2.6. Let's do a very narrow set of stairs first. Start with 2.1.2. We can go there and then I don't know if that'll be Begin up. Let's try. We can only try. All right, staircase. Now we can put fabric on here. The question would be the details, we can only use materials, but we can use patch fabric which is okay I can live with patch fabric uh, but it, it does stretch the pattern if you know what I'm saying it on the staircase your fabric is is, is like scary stuff maybe we should go with like a burnt orange and we can do dirty wood We can always change the colors and then we'll go with now we can use damaged plastic and then we can color it any way we want see what this looks like oh, i'm not walking i'm flying Gonna be too deep. Okay. Let's move this over a little bit. Let's 
that away. So wait. Okay, well that'll work. Will this work? Okay, well that'll work. The question is. bad. The stairs actually look quite narrow here. Seriously? Why am I not able to sell them? Thank you. Then we can actually build a wall here. Go down. Damn it. a section in the middle here that we can either just block in let's see do not sell the stuff close it One of those days I am we can maybe put something under the stairs. Anything that's facing here we do. Hmm, maybe. Okay, let's, I don't quite know what I want to do with the walls, so I'm not going to do the walls yet, but let's put a stair railing on, and we want it on, no, the right. Do we want it on both sides? Maybe. Let's see what we're going to do with it first. Hey. Let's start with dirty wood. And then we can move our way along. I do that. Oh, this isn't even touching. How is that not touching? Why is that not touching? Nope, not that one. serious yeah. 
Okay, if I say open, it was touching, I swear to goodness. Fine. I'll fix it. <laughs> I just don't like the stair the, the, the banister on both sides. I think I'm going to only use the banister on the right side. And we need to figure out the banister. So definitely not the glass. Maybe that. See, I might build the wall up, I might not. It all depends. And then we're upstairs. I hate the repeating pattern in the ceiling. I think it is absolutely horrible. So, well, it's not the ceiling, it's the moldy paint, moldy, moldy wood. Yes, this. So we are not going to be keeping that. It looks good from the outside, but looks absolutely horrendous from the inside. So we will be removing that. And then we just need to fill in some gaps that the roof left. I might keep it in one or two places, but definitely not. Oh, damn it. Hold on. A limited by roof. Yes. Yeah. Used. Okay, it wasn't too bad. <laughs> Did I do any more damage? No, I didn't. Okay. Yeah. Oh, now you're limited by the roof. Okay, you're not going to be limited by the roof. Right here, right now. Thank you. Just that one spot. Alright, that will be limited by the roof because of the angle. And that one too, and that one as well. But I'm thinking ceilings because this is terrible. So what we're going to have is we will have the staircase, probably a wall here. Then there will be a bedroom, maybe a bathroom, and then probably two bedrooms over there. So this is going to be a huge upstairs and we will then close this in. I wonder if I should just build, can you see what it's glitching with here? Are you happy now? I'm so glad. Now can we fix you? No. Nope. 
are you glitching with the probably this maybe this doesn't load right don't like it because those stairs don't look right you're gonna stick out Yep. Okay, let's close you off. Okay. Oh, in the kitchen and the dining room are going to be here. So we'll see what we're going to do. I wonder. staircase down here. Can I change that to open? Can I get a staircase? wherever we want it to go. Have we got a little door to fit in here? Doorway. Okay. And if we bring it out. I suppose we should figure out if we can actually do this before we do it, eh? Can I walk? No, I can't. Okay, bye. Open that. that for now. Then we can see what the heck we're doing. If I make a hole in the ground. Hole in the ground. Just go all the way and whoopsie. Always do this. All right, so we are underground now. We are under the house. I'm really bad at doing the under the house thing, but it is what it is. Can we put stairs in? Going down. Thank you. 
1.4 meters it will need to be a little bit deeper here and work this way, shall we? Three meters. Two point six meters. Put a floor. Oops. Let's see if we can put a staircase in here. Don't think we've got enough space yet. I'll refine it. Where are you? In. Better. Oh. That's funny. Did not do that. This actually, we've got to do the circle. So, height, let's do the height here. We can just clear this out for now. So, we can see if we can get a staircase in. If not, we can put it somewhere else, not a train smash. I just want to see if we can. What staircase would you put in a basement? I'm guessing a an open one. Maybe. Damaged wood on it. Hitting. You're okay to the so it's that hole there. What am I taking away here? Nothing that cannot be taken away, so that's fine. There we go. Okay. My, my head a little bit. Okay. And that's why it's always good to check. Awesome. So we can get down under the stairs, which means we can build our wall. Which Oh, 
close this whole thing off from the staircase. Okay, let's leave that open. Hmm. That'll be fine. But we won't be able to put a door in there because the stair is there. Okay, this is going to have to be closed off. About... It's an exterior door. I like that exterior door. This door is just too pretty. this one that opens awesome oh, flip it the other alternative is which way does this door open We can use that as a shelf for the pantry. We can do that for sure. Okay, I'm going to take that as a win. Then I'm literally going to pull this up so the whole staircase is enclosed. It's a little claustrophobic, but then that will take us. Enclose this as well. Let's just use what we've got on the floor at the moment. And then we can probably build a bookcase in that. That's open because it's a staircase. We probably don't need it open. Let's check. Yeah, we're going to need it open. That's fine. We can put a railing over it, or a broken railing, or whatever. This can be closed off. Okay. Ow! I swear I was using that. the bumps and the lumps but I'm thinking of like little secrets hidden away in little cupboards in little places so it might work and that's the back patio this is the main floor and I think let's keep the white ceiling through here How bad is the pattern? Eh, it's not as bad as some of them. So I think I'll keep the white ceiling in the whole place. The 
we might put the yellow ceiling in here from the fireplace and then we can go ahead and close this all because then that's the dining room and we can not the dining room, the living room wish we could have broken glass in the doors wouldn't that be cool I want the door that I had I used in my old bowl the one that you could actually see through it and the parlor and then this will be kitchen and the dining room that is centered oh, I put some of the shingles on here as well so I think I want to close this off as well as sort of an entryway This is the front door. Use that. Because then we've got the living room, the dining room, and the kitchen. Very rarely I make a, a, a house with an actual entrance. <laughs> but I think this one deserves it. And then the staircase is hidden behind here. Unless we open... Yes, I'm walking. <laughs> hmm under the stairs actually I'm okay with that we can decide if we're going to divide the kitchen because I'm quite happy to do that we don't need a huge dining room but then we have the fireplace that might be kitchen dining room that put the door there and took this out that would also work Let me know. But I'm quite enjoying the weirdness. Now, if I take that and put it on there, then it won't be. Hmm. The other alternative. will be if we leave this open and close 
that up. That looks a little logical, don't you agree? And we have the door to the kitchen. We have the stairs. And then we have the door to the dining room and the living room. Let me know. I can just imagine creaking doors and all kinds of weird stuff. We need to look at. I'll do it. Ooh. That, went, that was weird. That door doesn't like opening very wide. You see that? I actually quite like that. <laughs> Alright. So. Let me know. Give me ideas. What paper should, what wallpaper should I put on here? Um, should it be something really strange? Should we have some more hidden rooms? This can be a really nice bookshelf. Yes, it's not the right height yet, but I will put a wall, uh, a, a ceiling on here maybe leave that I'm not sure because I quite like that just I don't know how we'll do that well I do but it's going to be a pain and we've got a hole there and again but we'll get it but yeah, maybe a door here with a couple of hidden items in the cupboard. Could be fun. So guys, I'm finally taking my keys off keys off the handboard. <laughs> my hands off the keyboard. And um, I'm going to take a breather, take a break, and then any suggestions leave it down in the comments and we can come back and have a look i'm sorry these look like they'd vanished but they haven't they are definitely still there okay guys i hope you all have a good weekend tomorrow it's starting tonight tomorrow and I will see you all soon. Take care. Bye.